Hello and welcome to HBM's Crypto Corner for Wednesday, October 10th, 2018. We have a few news items to discuss and a few other things to probably uh, talk about as well. So let's get started. The late Dr. Grover Krantz left quite a legacy, including a cousin named Laura who has started up a podcast called Wild Thing. She is a veteran public radio editor and producer. And she was actually at the um, the 50th anniversary uh, celebration of the Patterson Gimlin film last year. And she has a new podcast called Wild Thing, in which she talks a little bit about Squatch. And her first episode, I have not listened to it yet, but it is about Grover Krantz, who was her famous cousin. So this is pretty exciting. She has a Facebook page and she also has a website. So if you want to get in contact with her on Facebook, uh, I guess you can get in contact with her through the, uh, the Facebook page for the podcast. So this is exciting stuff. More news about the podcast here in just a second. This article, also from Crypto Mundo, says the Wild Thing podcast is like cereal for Sasquatches. I don't mean cereal as in the cereal you eat. Now this is a picture of Laura from last year. This was at the 50th anniversary celebration. <coughs> it's a nine part series. Oh wow, okay. It's a look into her family history as well. Including of course her famous cousin Dr. Grover Krantz. So this is pretty cool, that not only is she going to talk about Sasquatch, she's going to talk about her famous family. So, hey. She is, um, she's pretty nice. I, I met her. She was very nice. Met her last year. So, um, wishing her luck. Hey, listen. I am uh, excited about listening to the, uh, the podcast and uh, getting some, uh, some good information. So this should be some cool stuff. I'm going to keep you guys posted on this weekly, by the way, or however, however long she uh, released, whenever she releases a new podcast. We'll just put it that way. There are several Bigfoot-related events coming up, including the Texas Bigfoot Conference, which is one week from this upcoming weekend, October 19th through the 20th. It marks the 51st anniversary of the Patterson Gimlin film. Confirmed speakers will be Bob Gimlin, Dr. Jeff Meldrum, Lyle Blackburn, Ken Gerhard, Nick Redfern, and Shelley Covington, Montana. So that's a pretty exciting lineup. And here's the schedule, or a schedule. So, and the host is, hotel is going to be the Executive Inn and Suites in Jefferson, Texas. Uh, I don't know if tickets are still available or not. They might be, but then again, they might not be. It may not be it may not be completely sold out. So, maybe you can get your hands on a ticket or two, who knows. But, you know, it looks like a pretty exciting event. Wish I could oh, I wish I was able to go. Oh well, maybe next year. And then the weekend after that is Creature Weekend, and uh, there's going to be some pretty exciting stuff going on there. This will be at Salt Fork State Park in uh, Ohio. Of course, that's the same location as the Ohio Bigfoot Conference. Amy Boo is going to be speaking this year. She was what you might call a last-minute addition, and that's pretty exciting. Ed Squatch, a.k.a. Ed Wyland, I believe, is going to be there. There will be several local Bigfoot groups. <coughs> let's see. And let's go to the uh, speakers. The, the speakers page. Here we are. 2018 speakers. Yep, Amy Boo. Well, David Ellis was supposed to speak, but unfortunately he couldn't make it. He can't make it. 
So, but yeah, Bob Gimlin's going to be there. This guy. Stanton Freeman, the godfather of UFOs. Also, let's see, here's an individual. Bruce Champagne. Yeah, cool. Amy Boo, as we mentioned. And those are the speakers for Creature Weekend this year, October 26th through 27th of this year. There are going to be several other speakers as well, and uh, looks like an exciting and fun event. I think tickets may still be available for this one as well. And of course, lodging. You have lodging at the, you know, at the lodge and at, ca at the cabins, and, or if you want to camp out. You want to go to one of the campsites. There are numerous campsites at Salt Fork State Park. So you got lots to choose from. Lots of activities, too. So, there you go. And the final big event that's coming up is the Sasquatch Summit, November 16th through the 18th, the weekend right before Thanksgiving. And some pretty exciting speakers are going to be there as well. The one and only Bob Gimlin, Adam Davis, Joe Hauser, The Olympic Project, Tom Powell, Richter Riolo, Tom Cantrell, and Dr. Jeff Meldrum. That is the lineup of speakers for the Sasquatch Summit. <coughs> and again, I believe tickets are still available for this event as well. So if you're planning on going, you know, uh, now is the time to do it. I believe you can also get tickets at the door if you're so inclined. So, looks like three great events are about to take place. From what I understand, they had the Hodabi Bigfoot Festival this past weekend. Lyle Blackburn, Ken Gerhard, M.K. Davis, um, somebody else. There were, some, there were other speakers. There were, there were a few other speakers. The ones that I remember were uh, M.K. Davis, Lyle Blackburn, and Ken Gerhard. There were others. Forgive me if I forget who the other ones were. Brain fart. <laughs> but uh, I believe somebody named Tanya Stewart, I think it was. I'm not sure. But yeah, it looked like it was a pretty exciting time and pretty fun time as well. Oh, Igor. Igor Bertsev was there as well. That's right, Igor. Igor Bertsev. He was another speaker there. So, very exciting stuff, ladies and gentlemen. I've been getting a few goodies as of late. Today I got my orders from Small Town Monsters and Monstro Bizarro. From Small Town Monsters I got the Mothman of Point Pleasant t-shirt with artwork by Sam Sheeran. The Flatwoods Monster DVD and the On the Trail... No, no! On the Trail of Champ and Beast and Bray Road Beast. Now, from... Uh, from Monstro Bizarro, I got the Boggy Creek Swamp Stalker t-shirt, the Flatwoods Monster DVD, and the hardcover edition of Beyond Boggy Creek, signed by Lyle Blackburn. So, some good some good stuff there. I've been getting a few goodies, a good few other goodies as of late. Some books, t-shirts, all kinds of cool stuff. So, anyway, um... <clears throat> Let's see, the Ohio Bigfoot Conference, two speakers have already been announced for the OBC for this year. Cliff Berkman and James Bobo Fay. Now, some may think, well, are those the same people that were there last year? Well, hey, if you think you can do any better, uh, put your own conference together. Hold your own conference. If you don't want to hear Cliff and Bobo again, don't go. <laughs> Plain and simple. You know, I plan on being there myself. I plan on being at the OBC, the Ohio Bigfoot Conference 2019. I'm pretty sure Mark is going to announce another speaker sometime this week. Which should be pretty exciting. OhioBigfootConference.com Of course, they are on Facebook. Gosh, seems like everybody's on Facebook these days. Yeah. <laughs> I, in fact, everybody is on Facebook these days. So... There you go. Can't complain about that. 
Anyway, guys, um, also, tonight, since I'm recording this on Wednesday, I'm releasing this on Wednesday, tonight, real or not real, on the Skinner1472 channel, you guys might want to check that out, 8 Eastern, 7 Central, we're going to be talking about various videos from the paranormal, Bigfoot, ghosts, UFOs, aliens, all kinds of cool stuff, lake monsters, and we're going to determine if they are real or not. Are they, are, you know, are they what they claim to be? Are they what they represent themselves to be? Or are they hoaxes? We're going to make that determination with a good panel discussion. We have several good panelists on the, on the show and we always have a great time. So try and remember to tune in 8 Eastern, 7 Central. You can find the link on the Looking for Bigfoot Facebook group, by the way, in case you want to tune in at 8 Eastern, 7 Central tonight. We always enjoyed uh, ourselves doing this show. We've, we've, we've had that show, we've had the uh, Looking for Bigfoot shows going for five years now. We've really had a lot of fun doing it. We've had folks that have come and gone, but we have always had a lot of, a lot of great fun doing it. And I'm, you know, proud to be part of it. So, pretty exciting stuff. Um, we're going to be doing a Real or Not Real every week leading up to Halloween. Now, I'm going to take Halloween off. There will not be an HBO's Crypto Corner on Halloween, October 31st. I'm taking that day off. But, but, I'm not going to let you guys down that week. There will be a show on November 1st. I'm just taking Halloween off. Doesn't mean there's not going to be a show that week. There will be a show on November 1st, the next day. I'm just taking Halloween off. So, <clears throat> that week of October 29th through the November 2nd, the show will be on November 1st. So, I hope you guys can tune in. Oh, and Happy Halloween. I love this time of year. Let me know if you guys love the fall season as well, as much as I do, especially October. October is my favorite month of the year because it's Halloween season. I love Halloween. So anyway, yeah. Thanks for tuning in, guys. I know this is a bit of a shorter show than the ones that I have done, but uh, hope you guys enjoy it. And thank you for the support of this channel. And all of my subscribers, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed last week's special edition about uh, Jerry Crew. Um, something I forgot to mention, and I'll mention it now, uh, it was 56 years ago to the day, this past Saturday, that Tom Slick was killed in a plane breakup over Montana. And we're, we're talking 56 years to the very day. And he was an important benefactor for for Sasquatch research and for Bigfoot um, for Bigfoot studies and things like that, and the Yeti as well. So anyway, I thought you, I thought you guys would like to hear about that and know about that. It has been 56 years since we lost Tom Slick. Ooh. So anyway, thanks guys for tuning in. I've been a little bit under the weather lately, but I'm getting starting to get better. And hopefully I'll start getting even better, even more better as the days progress. <coughs> uh, anyway, uh, I'm going to... Oh, I also got the new Bigfoot Times newsletter yesterday. Really great articles in there, including, some, including an article by T.A. Wilson, why he thinks the Glenn Thomas... Um, stories and claims are nothing but hoaxes. And there's a counter argument. Don't worry about that. Well, the thing is, I think it's healthy to have debate in the Bigfoot world. Not everybody's going to agree on every single case, whether it's legitimate or not. But, you know, hey, we all, we're all in this together. You know, whether, whether we agree or not, we're all in this together. And I respect T.A. Wilson. Uh, his books are great. I think his books are great. I don't agree with every conclusion he comes to, but I respect him. 
you know, and he he's always been nice to me. He sent me, you know, autographed copies of his books. He was that was very nice of him, which was pretty cool. So uh, anyway, yeah, if you if you guys want to get a hold of some cool merchandise, smalltownmonsters.com, monstrobizarro.com. They got some great cool Bigfoot items. Well, not just Bigfoot, but they got you know they got Flatwoods Monster, they got Mothman, they got Invasion on Chestnut Ridge. They got they got uh, the Bray Road Beast. You know, Lyle's got the Falk Monster stuff. He's got the T-shirts. He's got the the books and the DVD and everything. So can't go wrong with that. I mean, it's great. It's very cool. Of course, um, Small Town Monsters has like the Mothman and Flatwoods Monster and Champ. Oh, yeah, I forgot about Champ. You have the new Champ DVD as well. So, very cool stuff. Very cool stuff. MonsterBizarro.com and SmallTownMonsters.com. So, anyway, guys, <coughs> I feel like I'm about to lose my voice. So, I'm going to shut this puppy down. And thanks for tuning in. And uh, appreciate you guys. And you know, again, head on over to Skinner 1472 channel and check out Real or Not Real tonight, eight Eastern, seven Central. Thank you guys to be. I think you guys will enjoy it. I think you'll be surprised. So anyway, thanks guys for tuning in. Y'all be good or be good at it. This is an HBM Crypto Corner.